up YouTube? Welcome back to the trucking journey. I'm Trucker Jim and we are about to get back on the road. Just finished a 10 hour break. We've had a nice hot shower. Just doing a quick walk around. Any of you guys drive a truck that uses natural gas? I have never done such a thing. But this is gonna be a great running day through Alabama, Mississippi, Louisiana, on into Texas, all in today's shift. I was about to grab a little snack there in the Flying J. But you know, they've got stuff like pizza and chicken strips, I don't know, burritos and, and things like that. All of it's a little carb heavy. But nah, when I do eat today, because I'm getting ready to have my bulletproof coffee, so I'm good. I will continue with the fast that started last night. And with all these food choices in front of me, why would I want to get fast food? I could have Gator Bites. I could have Crackling. What else could I have? I could have Moe's. Yeah. Three Amigos. But it is time to say adios to our, my Amigos at the Flying J. And we're going to get on the road. Using the pocket camera again. My big camera. I put it in the case. It don't even have the microphone on. I have not felt the desire to bring it out. But with this little guy... Whenever I, I don't know, have a little something I, I want to say, I can say it with the quickness. The other requires a little setup, a little planning. It's real easy just not to do anything. That is smooth as butter. Hey guys, there's this truck in front of me, okay? And its name is on the trailer. And there's some drivers in it that should probably apply. Y'all see that? Super Ego. I did not frame that very well. already my truck is dirty and I do mean dirty y'all want to see a little buttery b-roll of my dirty truck Before the end of the day we'll change it because we're gonna be bobtailed for a while there's gonna be a few blue beacons we go by so I really have no excuse and I have not done a break yet and we're not gonna do a break here we're gonna get moving people so uh y'all ready to get back trucking <laughs> Give it up. Oh, 
just looking at me strange, but you know I don't care. I step up in this mother. Just a swank in my hand. Trick, quit talking, crip, walk, kick you down with the set. Take a bullet with some grip and take the smoke on the jet. Out of town, put it down for the father of rap. And if you happen to get cracked, trick, shut your trap. Come back, get back. That's the part of success. If you believe in the S, you'll be relieving your stress. All right. I'm glad some of you made it all the way through that. Did I overdo it? But I thought it was a beautiful sunset in Houston, or leaving Houston. But I'm in San Antonio. The, the truck's back there. I've got a delivery in the morning. And guys, I'm not doing a real good job of eating healthy. I have not, I don't even have an avocado. I don't even have an egg. I hadn't prepared and cooked a meal yet. I do have some chicken. But I don't feel like cooking chicken because, well, there's a, a jerk in the box, a jack in the box across the street, but I'm not going there. There's a QT, and there is a favorite little flat wrap, I think is what they're called, that I just absolutely love from QT. So um, I'm going to grab one of those for a late night snack. Whew. You know, I could order at the machines, but QT has an app. And it's just as easy to do it with it. Is your kitchen closed? Is the kitchen closed? Yes. Well, that sucks. But at least they don't have fresh donuts. So I won't grab any of those. I used to have a thing for apple fritters years ago. I haven't had an apple fritter in some time now. Well, I guess I will have to show you guys the barbecue chicken. Barbecue chicken bacon with jalapeno flatbed wrap. It's awesome, but we can't have that tonight. So, do we go back to the truck and heat up a can of like some soup or chew on beef jerky or eat nuts? I could make this uh, like chicken with bacon and barbecue sauce and cheese in the truck. I could do that. That sounds like a good idea, but I'm not. It would make this video too long and it'll, I would be up late. And I want to wash the truck in the morning because right across the road here is a blue beacon. And I am due. Do I want to go to Diddy's? Not really. We'll walk in Denny's and see what's up. If it's all depressing and nothing's going on, I ain't doing it. But if there's somebody else up at the bar, might have some conversation with another trucker, I'll order something. There's salmon, there's always a uh, egg and breakfast kind of stuff. But restaurants are kind of weird since this whole corona thing started. Well, there's no one at the bar. This is about as damn dead as a Denny's can possibly get. I'll record you there. <laughs> well, let's see. Alright, truck drivers. If you've come to this channel to find out how to be a healthy, super fit trucker, man, are you on the wrong channel. I am not being a good example. Guess what? I'm having for dinner two corn dogs and two pieces of take five. I would have three pieces of take five, but I gave one to a girl. Oh, by the way, YouTube, Trucker Jim's single. But I'm going to get up early and wash my dirty truck, and I will see all of you in the next episode. But until then, please be safe out there and keep on trucking.